All right, I just got home and I got a notice while we were out and about that my package got delivered. So let's take a look. Holy shit. Hey, 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 welcome back to the channel. So here's what we're gonna do today. You just saw that giant package on my porch. Today, we're gonna be upgrading the off-road machine. That's right, the 2014 Nissan Frontier. This is my everyday driver. This is my off-road pickup. This is my camping vehicle. This is everything. It is a four by four, and I don't know if you knew that they do this about Nissans, off-road edition. Uh, package for the Frontier. Uh, I've had this truck for a little over a year, uh, probably about a year and six months, maybe a year and a half at this point. Um, and it's not terribly tall. Like it's not that far off the ground. And I'm, I'm six foot tall. So, and no, it's not 5'11". With my shoes on, I'm six foot. I'm six foot people, okay? It's on my license. It's on my medical charts. You can ask my pediatrician, all that fun stuff. They're gonna verify six foot tall unit over here, okay? Uh, but for my fiance, Heather, and my son, Cody, uh, this is still a little bit taller than her Nissan Rogue, which is out in the street, uh, to hop in. So I've been thinking and wanting to put some steps on this truck. And that is where these come in. The Rough Country Nerf Steps that I ordered last weekend and they arrived today. Um, I've seen some photos of folks use these specific steps on the Frontiers and they just look absolutely gorgeous. So that's what we're gonna do this afternoon. We're gonna put these steps on the truck. I mean, look at that rig, an absolute unit. 2014 Nissan Frontier Off-Road Edition, four x four. Uh, I love the truck. It's a smaller truck than what I'd want to be my everyday driver. I'd love to have a normal uh, Silverado or a Sierra, but um, you know, with the economy being the way it is, the dollar only gets you so far. So this has to do in the meantime, and I absolutely love it. Um, I have no complaints about the vehicle. I just wanna put these steps on, flash it up a little bit. You never know, could maybe raise the truck a little bit higher, give it a little bit of a better stance. Uh, but we're gonna see, we're gonna see how it looks. And by no means am I a mechanic. Uh, my brother, Dylan, who sometimes is featured on the Schmidt Happens YouTube channel, he's the guy that does the wrenching around here. Uh, my son always says, well, get Uncle Dylan to fix it if it's broken. Well, no, I can fix it. I can put that stuff on the truck. So that's what I'm gonna do today. Um, it should be very simple. I'm gonna lift these things under, I'm gonna bolt them on, they're gonna look great, and it's gonna do exactly what I need it to do. So follow along with me and we'll get these bad boys on the truck. Oh hey, good to see you down here. I'm checking out uh, the bolt situation, the layout, just to make sure that I have uh, these things on the right side. So taking the camera here, look, there are, let's see if I can get this, two bolts right here. Um, they're all spaced out. There's there's three sets of pairs um, along each side of the truck. The steps themselves, all they did was come with uh, just, just a pack of 12 bolts. There's nothing else, no instructions. You literally just lift the steps up. You put the bracket on these, uh, these bolts here. And then you take the nuts. I may have said a, a bag of 12 bolts bag of 12 nuts and you tighten them and that's it that's all she wrote so that's what we're gonna do now um probably could use two people uh to lift and make sure that i'm getting this right but i'm a big dude i can handle it you know so that's what we're gonna do and hopefully i don't crush my teeth in because i spent a lot of money on these at one point while well, my parents did uh for braces so i'm gonna try to make sure that i keep the money maker uh fresh clean and and safe okay safety glasses on always because uh safety first around here. Am I right? Um, no, it's not a safety thing. I just, I'm very blind and I can't see. So I got to wear these or else I'm not going to see shit when I'm trying to line up these bolts. Oh, and just like that, they're on. Uh, it probably took uh, maybe, I don't know, five, 10 minutes each side. It really didn't take that long. Um, like I said, it's really simple. You just take these uh, rough country nerf steps Line them up with your bolts, or yeah, with your bolts, take your nuts, 
um, thread them on there, tighten them, you're good to go. I'm, uh, I'm gonna make a pass at each, uh, at each side here to make sure that everything's tightened up and then we should be good to go. Um, very simple install, I'm very happy with it. The quality of product is really nice. This matte, um, you know, kind of powder finish um on the on the steps is real nice and and it's it should hold up to the weather from all the reviews that i've read and uh, i'll kind of give you guys a shot of what the whole thing looks like while it's up but um I'm, I'm really happy with it so uh like i said for the for the kiddo and for the fiance uh it's gonna work just right for them to get in the truck um i'll be stepping over it every time because i won't need it but it's gonna benefit them and if i ever get a hair to lift the truck up a little bit more uh, that'll help too. So uh, I'll kind of give you guys an overview shot here and then we'll wrap this one up. So here's the finished product. All installed, secured tightly. Um, I think it's a good look for the truck. It, uh, it, it puts a little bit of, you know, flair on it that it didn't have. You know, it kind of makes it, um, you know, a little bit more unique. I, did, I didn't want to just do a long running style board. You know, I, I liked the, I liked the two steps. Uh, I think it was a much cleaner look and I'm actually very happy with, with the way it turned out. So like I said, they'll get to use it now. Um, rough country nerf steps. If you guys are looking to put anything on your truck, um, I think this is a good option if you're wanting to get those steps. So that way you can, um, you know, have the, have the assistance needed if folks need to get in your vehicle, but also, um, just makes the vehicle look a lot nicer too, in my opinion. It just, uh, all that dead space between the wheels, it just, it, it lines up with the style of this truck very well. Um, kind of lines up with that off-road concept, even though, yes, it is a 2014 Nissan Frontier that not a lot of people think would be an off-road vehicle, but you know, hey, I use it in the woods. I take it to the property and up to the cabin, so it's going to work just fine for us. So I appreciate you guys stopping by. Um, we did reach 400 subscribers for our binocular giveaway. So look out for that follow-up video. That'll be the next video that comes out. We'll announce the winner of that. That just might be you if you're here and you're subscribed. So I appreciate you guys stopping by. We'll see you next time.